hi guys welcome back this is part three of the my hair growth routine in twist series if you have not seen part one and two i will link them in the description below so feel free to go and check them out with that said let's get into what i'm actually doing in this video so i am conditioning my hair which is usually the third step in my wash day routine and I am using my DIY aloe vera gel conditioner which I made a video showing you guys sorry about the dogs guys I will leave that video in the description just in case you haven't seen it so in part two you guys saw me washing my hair in twist I would really love if you haven't seen that video to check it out because there's a lot of information on how to wash your hair in twist to get a clean scalp and also to get clean hair yeah so that's that and i am also conditioning my hair in twist this is what i do on wash days i not only shampoo my hair in twist but i also condition my hair in twist as well however i do have the option of taking down one twist at a time applying the conditioner and retwisting them but depending on how i'm feeling on wash day and what my schedule is like i usually just condition my hair in the twist i've been doing this for years now and it's what works for me i believe that you should always choose what works for you over what everyone else seems to be doing your hair is unique you are unique and not because something is working for someone else means it will work for you so i've just stuck with this routine and i don't think i will be you know switching to anything else anytime soon yes I, i'm curious about trying out new things but for now especially with the schedule that i have i am sticking to what i know works for me this is a pretty easy and fast process literally what i'm doing is i'm just applying the condition over my twist and once i'm done i just wrap everything up and then i'll proceed to cover my hair with a scandal bag <laughs> that's in the case that i don't have a shower cap which i did have in this video so you guys will be seeing me using a shower cap but if you've been watching my videos for a while you you will realize that there are times when i just use a scandal bag because that's what i have i keep my routine pretty simple because i don't always have the time and honestly i don't always want to be in my hair so i just try to do things that makes my life easier and keeps me as stress-free as possible the life as it is is enough to deal with and the truth is your mental health is also important you have to take care of you first before you can take care of your hair because when you're too exhausted you won't spend the time to be gentle to be patient and to just give your hair the love even your thoughts will not be in the right place to take care of your it's hair. hard to think positive when you're tired when you're stressed when you're annoyed and that's exactly what overcomplicating your routine will cause to happen. So guys, please just keep it simple. Don't get caught up with the crowd that is trying out everything new and then get left behind. In the past, I did try other people's routine, was left disappointed and had to go back to what I know works for me. So i really just don't focus on what everybody else is doing anymore i just do what i know works i advise that if something is working for you in your routine just stick to it there's nothing to be ashamed of and you certainly don't need to think that you are missing out but if you are going to try new things do so with caution keeping in mind that they might not work but also having the confidence to go back to what works without feeling like a failure because it is a learning process.